Hey guys, it's Erica. We're checking out BTS. I got my BTS shirt off. First time I'm actually wearing this shirt. And so this is forever, or forever yours. What the fuck? I just, sorry. Um, <laughs> it says love yourself answer on the back. I'm not going to turn around and stuff. Um, but it does and stuff. So yeah, we got BTS Airplane Part 2, the Japanese version. So I'm really excited that they decided to make, um, a music video for this one. And, um... That it's, um, a different, that, like, um, for the Japanese comeback for them, that they did, um, not, what, what, um, not Idol and stuff, that they did a different track for that, so we get a variety of our content. Not like that wouldn't be variety in the content, but it's, it's like a different song. And so if I'm interested to hear, um, how the Japanese sounds, Japanese version, I don't know a word of Japanese, so I kind of base my likeness on it on like the flow of the stuff. My camera been going in and out of focus all day, sorry. Um but in and but um fuck. Uh words Erica train of thought, let's get on it, get on the track. Um I base my likeness on the songs in different languages based on just like the flow and the feel and if it appeals to me or not. So sometimes hit or miss and stuff. Uh lately been hits instead of misses, but um yeah, we're going to be checking this out. I'm really excited to see just, like, just, I'm just really happy they did, um, like, a, a it's, it's, it's beat track, though, right? Um, for, like, the Japanese comeback and stuff, because I think it's really cool that they get their own, um, a variety and stuff of the, um, uh, music video and the song and stuff that they decide to promote. I think it's really cool and stuff, and I also love the song, too, and stuff. Well, we'll see how their El Mariachi, uh, pronunciation goes this time, because, work on it just, just, just a little bit more and stuff ain't gonna lie but um yeah so you know with it let's go stained glass windows a bar schmooty those look like outfits they would wear on stage for this I forgot he dyed his hair <laughs> for like the first time ever. That was the dope cut. I was expecting it all to be in like that bar. Namjin for you right there. That's a lot of bottles that bar has, I'm just saying. Angle's interesting. Can you not please bias? So they say the place is like Hong Kong e Brazil. I don't know why and is in Japanese, but e is and in Spanish. Can you? You ever know when your bias is just doing too much and you just he just need to chill? That's what Jungkook needs to do. Oh, homie, he dancing on the bar. It's Coyote Ugly up in here. <laughs> That's how the bar lights change. Get your moves, Hobie. Oh. The flow of the Japanese is really dope. I like it. I like it when they're almost like silhouetted with the light coming through that stained glass. It's dope. I also like the sort of colors that it has. The deserty sort of colors. Fringe game on fleek, Yugi.
a courtyard sort of place. It's raining. They dancing in the rain. The choreography is also really dope for it, even though I've seen it before. Not in person, but their live performances. Can you not, please? My bias needs to not. And so the flow of the Japanese was kind of really, really dope. Might like it a little bit better. Well, in certain parts, I liked it. I liked the flow of it more in the Korean part than the Korean. And then in other parts, I was feeling the Korean version rather than the Japanese version. So, not that each one was better than the other and stuff. It's just, I don't know. Like, it, it, it hit me in my feels and stuff. I really like the sort of um, color sort of... Uh, aesthetic, I guess you would say, for the music video, very deserty. What do you, what do you like? Deserty colors, like the yellow and the green and stuff. Uh, I guess what I forgot what it was called. Um, but yeah, it was it was really dope. I like the sort of bar setup and everything. When um, J Hope was dancing on the bar, that was pretty dope and stuff. When they're doing the choreography, it was really dope. But when that first chorus hit, those those camera angles they they shook me up because. Those are normally the camera angles, I guess, we get when we, um, in, like, K-pop music videos, even though this is, like, Japanese version. Um, but even in those ones, the camera angles are more or less similar and stuff. So, yeah, I always love reacting to BTS to Japanese uh, music videos because, uh, they, they always are sort of just, like, different. And they, they sort of, I, I don't think this one played into the story of the whole freaking theories and everything that stress me out but um yeah they, they would into that and that's really cool that like they um sort of do the the sort of when they would play with the the concept of most beautiful moment in life and uh was it was when what else did they do it with but like when they were doing that sort of the the, the theories that stress armies out um my camera out of focus. There we go. Um, that, like, that the Japanese music videos were playing to it as well. So you had a bit, like, they also would tease the next comeback in the Japanese ones very, very often. But, um, but yeah, it's cool that you get that variety in the content in there. And it kind of makes the fans pay attention to everything they release and stuff. And I really enjoyed it. It was really dope and stuff. I really liked when they, that, like, the stained glass window and the light coming through. That was really, really dope and stuff. The choreography, killer. That, I think they were killing it more in here than when I saw, or when I checked out the live performance that they did for their Korean comeback and stuff. So, that that's really dope and stuff. Maybe we'll get a dance practice one of these days and stuff for, um, airplane, or airplane part two, yeah. And stuff. It was, it was dope and stuff. I really liked it. It was, it was cool and stuff. The different angles were dope. Um, it was, it was really dope and stuff. Um, it was... I don't like the kind of, like, I'm not a, like, depending on the CG that's done in a music video, I like it or I don't like it and stuff. For this one with, like, the CG of, like, the sky in the background, it kind of is reminiscent of uh, DNA and what, like, Idol did, but I, I wasn't a huge fan of the, the fake sky or whatever and stuff, but the courtyard was pretty dope. And stuff influenced from the Spanish architecture, Spanish architecture, Southwest architecture, Mexican architecture. I don't know what you would call it specifically, but but yeah, it was it was really dope. I really enjoyed it. It was it was fun. It was nice and stuff that we the fans got a music video for this. I know all your armies were waiting for this and stuff, hoping that they would drop a music video, and they they did. And stuff. so I think the fans would probably really really like it. I know they enjoyed it because I'm out of like posts I saw about it that I had to avoid on social media of just this and stuff so yeah it was it was really dope I really enjoyed it it was cool and stuff so yeah go ahead and put your thoughts in the comments down below what you thought about BTS's airplane mode part 2 Japanese version your thoughts comments down below if you like this video go to the video thumbs up if you liked me and want to see more of my videos go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you want to see my videos when they come out I forgot my outro I've done brain fart I'm gonna just go from 
If you liked me and want to see more of my videos, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. If you want to see my videos the second they come out, hit that notification button. If you want to follow me on social media, Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, Tumblr, Facebook page, all that's in the description down below or at the end screen. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. Love you, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.